Hello everyone, good morning, welcome back to the kitchen table. Um, before we go any further, as is tradition on the channel, the beverage of choice today is the, uh, it's the Guatemalan coffee, of course, home roasted in this fantastic mug. It was my birthday this week, so I apologise that we haven't got an all singing, all dancing, exciting, flighty video or anything like that, but I had two days off this week and just wallowed. And it was foggy here and not really flyable anyway. Um, but uh, if I'm awarding prizes for the best birthday card, it's this one. I never have more than one glass. Somebody knows me far too well, don't they? So, a um, couple of things I wanted to say today. First of all, I want to say a hearty thank you and cheers to all my channel patrons because it's um, the this is the first video since we ended the August month, the first month of running the Patreon campaign, and uh, just amazing. Uh, thank you to everybody who's um, decided to become a patron. That's just blown me away. Brilliant news. And uh, I look forward to speaking to all of you on Sunday when we'll be doing our um, our little live video chat and I'll be giving the patrons some updates of previews of what's, what's upcoming and, and news about the channel and, and various other bits and pieces. So to you guys, cheers. To everybody who made a one-off donation as well last month, that's just brilliant and awesome and I thank you very much as well. Um, far too many of you to, uh, to name did that, so that's out outrageously brilliant of you. Um, Thank you. That's fantastic. It means I can do more of the stuff that you're starting to gonna start to see around you on the on the on the table soon. So um, that's the formalities out the way. Um, one reminder before we get into the substantive part of the video: uh, it's the closing date for questions for DJI tomorrow. That's Sunday UK time. The survey will close. I've got. One shy of 100, 99 questions in so far, which is fantastic. Because one of the things I can say to DJI is, well, look, we only got through 20 questions. I've got another 80 at home or more. Um, I think you need to think about making this a regular series. Um, and so, yeah, just again, if you could share that um, and, uh, you know, get the questions in. And then what we'll do is hopefully, fingers crossed, I'll trail it when it's, uh, it's um, going to be uh, actually put on the channel. And we can, um, you know, we can try and get uh, some really hot viewing figures for that video. And then I'm, I'm pretty sure I can twist some arms at DJI to say, can we make it a regular feature? Because there's obviously a demand for people. And what's great is that lots of you are asking very similar questions, which means I should be able to cover, you know, the information that loads of you wanted. So brilliant stuff on that. Uh, links to that video, which is explaining more about what we're doing and uh, has the link to the survey will be up here. Thank you. Right, um, now this video I wanted to talk, I, I kind of mentioned it a couple of videos ago, trailed it a little bit, that one of my patrons uh, is also an app developer. And he's sort of been approaching me and saying, look, you know, is, is there a market for apps for multi I, Do you know what, I had a look at what was out there and there's loads of apps that do one thing or another or a couple of things. There are some that do quite a lot, but they're, you know, light versions and you have to pay extra for modules and all the stuff that I didn't want to have to go into. Um, and, you know, we were having discussions and you know what we thought? How appropriate for on the kitchen table that rather than just sort of, you know, brainstorming away just the two of us, why don't we open it up and ask what you guys would like? So what we are proposing at the moment is all kind of blue sky. Um, but what we're proposing is, is, a, is a sort of a Swiss Army knife type app for multi rotors that will handle a load of things that you might be interested in: flight logging, battery flight timers, maintenance ti um, logging and countdowns, um, GPS status, weather, um, possibly no tams for sort of you know restricted airspace. Um, uh, K index for solar magnetic radiation, uh, solar storms, uh, you know, we're starting to sort of be a bit narrow in our focus because we're kind of, you know, picking out the same few things. So what we'd like to do is open it up to you guys and do a bit of crowdsourcing of, you know, what do you want? If there's no, if there's no burning desire for an app, we won't develop one. What's the point? Uh, if there is, then we can, we can add in all the things that are you know, people seem to want, and we can also um, ask you guys to help us to test it and make it really good. Um, now, up front, one of the things I didn't want to go down the road of is making it free, which of course is never free because there's development time to pay for. Um, you know, 
So we're not going to be doing a free app uh, paid by, by either by ads or uh, you know you get the core and then you buy a module and buy a module. This would be a paid app upfront about that if we're going to do it because you know there's no finance backing this or anything. It would be you know let's just let's just develop it so there'd be costs to be recovered. So it would be a paid app, um, but then once you paid that 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 fee, you'd get access to everything. Um, and that's another thing we need to ask you. Is it something you'd be prepared to pay for? If so, how much or how little? Um, because again, this will all drive us to, to whether we produce something. Um, so yeah, if what we've done is um, the developer has a SurveyMonkey account and has done, put together a little survey and it's down there in the description. If you could click on that and it asks you kind of how you use your multi-rotor and what would you want uh, you know what are your areas that you would want a, a sort of a one size app to cover um, be as blue sky as you like because one of the things that we're thinking of is whether or not we can you know pull down different APIs so mapping automatically log where you started your flying from your home point was um, uh, pull local weather conditions from local weather stations for you wind that sort of thing you know it's once you start thinking about these things, my brain started to go a bit mad. So that's where we came up with the idea that let's go to the source, you guys. So that's what we'd like you to do, if you wouldn't mind. Um, link in the description. Click through to that. Um, the channel patrons have already done this. Thank you, guys. You got a head start on that one for us. And, and that kind of gave me the, uh, the, the confidence that there was definitely this was worth exploring further. So, um, so yeah, if you could just answer that survey. No obligation, of course, as they say. Uh, but if you could pop your email address in there, if you are prepared to help with beta testing or alpha testing <laughs> or any other kind of feedback, but you don't have to. Um, I'm not, you know, you know me with the competitions. I don't collect your email addresses and then do nefarious things with them. Um, it's, uh, it's purely to, to help try and put together something that, that you as a community of pilots and owners would like. So that's that, really. Um, I've got lots of stuff coming up this week. Fingers crossed. The weather's been foggy this week. I know it's uh, two days off, but it really was. It was foggy all morning uh, on those two days. And by the time, you know, there was any flyable or filmable conditions outside, it was, you know, I had to go and do the other things I need to do. So, but I've got, uh, I've got a little review of something over there coming up. That just needs a final bit of uh, shooting doing and uh, editing up. That should hopefully come out early in the week. Uh, I've been sent, very excitingly, a, look, look, a bag of bits. What do we think all these are going to come to? Somebody has sent me some bits and pieces, and I'm going to have a little project on the go, which is building something. As you know, you've, those of you who've seen my Build the F450 uh, series, uh, my fledgling soldering skills will be tested. But this is, um, this is very interesting. I'm not going to say any more than that, because not, every, not everything is here yet. But some of you might be able to guess, some of you might not. So that's really good. Um, I've also got some product, uh, more products to test. I've just had a very interesting email conversation with um, a large organisation that is uh, wanting to send something through. I'm sorry to be vague, but I haven't, you know. So that's all really getting very exciting. Um, if you're a patron, um, then you, oh, I'll be able to speak a little bit more about that on, on, our, on our webcast on Sunday uh, this weekend. Um, but anyway, thank you very much for subscribing, for viewing, for liking, for disliking and commenting. I really appreciate it. If you don't like a video, can you put a comment in as to why? Because that's much better than just a hit and run, isn't it? Thank you. Um, for, for, for being patrons, for being donors, for being what, whatever you do to support, uh, whatever you can do, that's fantastic. And I really appreciate it. So for now, until next time, thanks very much. And I'll see you again soon on the kitchen table. Cheers.